What's up mga kamotorista? Adrian here. Welcome back sa isang na namang motorista adventures na video. For today's episode, pag-uusapan natin ang new Shangan CS35+. Plus. Na one year ago mga kamotorista, na drive ko na tong Shangan CS35+. Plus. Meron na tayong bagong facelift model natin as we've seen sa Mias 2022. And ipapakita ko sa inyo in this video kung ano yung mga changes na yun. And at the end of the video, I will give you the price. So, dalawang model yung pinakita ni Shangan dito sa ating CS35+. Plus. We have the CS35 Hype which is the white variant and meron din tayong CS35 Lux which is the red variant. So, yung differences ni ng dalawa is si Hype wala siyang black roof which is the Lux meron siyang black roof. Lux din mga motorista is meron siyang power tailgate which the Hype does not have. Yun lang talaga yung nagkakaiba sa kanya ng dalawa. Those are the only two features. If you want to shell out a little bit more for the CS35 Plus Lux, walang problema naman. So, let's move on to the engine and transmission first. So, yung ating engine ng ating CS35 Plus is a 1.4 liter turbocharged gasoline direct injection which is the same as the previous or the pre-facelip model. And yung displacement natin is 1,392 cc. Yung power natin from 158 dun sa pre-facelip model naging 160 na siya at 5,500 RPM yung power. And yung, yung torque naman natin is 260 newton meters no? So it is up again kasi 235 lang yun naalala ko before and now it's 260 which is a big bump naman. And it is available as low as 1,500 revs. Dito naman sa ating transmission, we get the same 7-speed dual clutch transmission with sport mode. We have a 53 liter tank capacity and yung curb weight ng ating CS35 Plus is 1,431 for the Hype and the Lux. But for the light or the base model variant, it's 1,380 which is a little bit more lighter. Si CS35 Plus has a McPherson strut up front and yung torsion beam natin is nasa likod. So it is still a budget suspension. A budget setup uh, if you compare it to a multi-link suspension setup sa ating CS75+. Plus. Now, when it comes to the brakes, we have ventilated disc sa harap, a solid disc sa likod. And yung parking brake natin is electronic parking brake na siya with electronic power steering na din. And yung ating steering wheel is tilt and telescopic. So yung wheels and tires din natin mga motorista. Now for the top of the line model, it has a 225 by 45 R18 alloy. And dito naman sa ating base model light, we get a thinner or a more narrow 215 by 55 R17 alloy. For the exterior looks natin, maganda siya mga motorista yung facelifted model. No? It is modern, it looks really really good, no? especially if you look at it in person. What's new here is yung ating headlights is all LED and yung top part pala mga motorista is the DRLs with positioning lamps. Um, yung ating headlight is on the bottom. No? You'd think na yung nasa bottom yung ating fog light pero that houses the headlights. And as, uh, meron din tayong high mount stop light sa likod and reverse camera na din with sensors as well. Sa likod din meron tayong dual tip exhaust. So sa ating interior naman mga motorista, leather seats, leather steering wheel, and equipped with 7-inch LCD meter cluster na siya. 4-way manual and 2-way electric yung ating seats. So kung gusto mo yung middle ground between manual seats and electric seats, you have this option sa ating uh, seat adjustment. Naka 4-way din siya manual lang. And 60-40 split folding yung ating second row of seats. Yung ating air conditioning mga motorista is automatic. I'm not sure if it is dual zone climate control. And if you look at the armrest and cup holders, we have an abundance of that sa interior din yah. Now for the sunroof, it is standard panoramic with anti pinch sa ating hype and lux. And multimedia system natin is the same across the board with a 10 inch touchscreen with. Bluetooth, USB connectivity, and smartphone mirroring. It's just sad na wala tayong Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. We get six speakers. Cruise control is adaptive with stop and go function, which is really really nice though. Kasi wala yan sa previous pre-face slip model. Meron tayong tano cover na din, wireless charging, and and a power tailgate for the Lux 
version. Now moving on to safety and security, yung airbags natin. For the locks and the hype, you get dual front airbags and side and curtain. So 6 airbags in total, anti-lock braking system, electronic stability program, brake assist, heel hold control, heel descent control, reverse camera, blind spot view camera and monitor, around view camera and monitor. Uh, reverse parking sensors and uh, remote engine start with immobilizer. Meron din tayong tire pressure monitoring system, speed sensing door locks, seat belt reminder, forward collision warning, and automatic emergency braking for the hype and the locks. So as you might have noticed, it is packed with a lot of features. Chang'an offers 5-year 150,000 kilometer mileage warranty. I'm not sure if uh, that's powertrain or uh, ano, pero again, 5 years, 150,000 kilometers. So they are very confident on about their vehicles. So that's it. No? If you want to take a look at the color availability, we have gray, white, and red. So yun yung tatlong uh, colors na pwede nyong pagpipilian. So yung ating new Shangan CS35 Plus is priced at 999000 for its entry-level model. Pero meron silang promo mga motorista, 898000 lang. Now for the Hype 1.4 DCT, it is uh, priced at 1149000 But you can get it now for 969 which is introductory price. And last but not the least is the top of the line locks at 1,169,000 Philippine pesos and you can only get it for below 1 million at 999,000. So if you tell me it, is it a good deal you're considering the, the amount of equipment that you're getting sa ating Shangan CS35 Plus. So what do you think mga motorista? Let me know down sa ating comments. And maraming salamat mga motorista for supporting this channel. Uh, thank you so much sa inyong mulang sawang pag no? So if you appreciate free content mga motorista, don't forget na mag-subscribe and like. That would help me mga motorista uh, to gain more subscribers as well as connect to more people. Thank you so much mga motorista sa susunod na mga video natin. Uh, once again, this is Adrian. You are watching Motorista Adventures and I'll see you on the next episode. Bye-bye!